Now, you'd be forgiven for paying no attention to those plain electrical boxes you see by the side of the road. But one artist in Leeds, armed with a paintbrush, is giving them a spot of colour. I want to take a look at his work. Go on, Gary Speed, get one yourself, son. And what a great goal! It's for Hunter, and it's a lovely goal! That's Lorimer! Oh, and a goal! This is the work of the burly Banksy. He takes average, nondescript streets in Leeds, like this one, and gives them a touch of personality. But unlike the real Banksy, we know who he is, and he's become quite a local celebrity. Andy McVeigh is the man behind the nickname. There's lots of these electricity boxes, well, everywhere, isn't there? And there's a, a lot around where I live that are all covered in horrible tagging. Um, and me and a friend just started painting over them with, like, trees and anything, flowers or something. And I was going down Welland Road one day, and, you know, there's loads of these boxes on the way down to the ground. And I thought, you know, I could do one. I could do a Leeds United one. I could do one there and one there. And I, I thought, yeah, I could create, like, a pathway to the stadium, almost. It's not just Leeds United theme, though. Walk anywhere across the city and you'll find loads of different references, from Headingley's Cricket Ground to High Park Corner. And he's also added some more personal touches. My sister's little girl was born and then they gave her six months to live. But if I do a box here for Gracie, you know, thousands of people will see her name every day. You know, and I think that kind of helped my sister. He's got permission for his work from the phone companies who own the boxes, and he's inspired some other artists to get involved with these murals. Everyone around Leeds seems to love his work. You know, it definitely brightens up and they keep changing all the time as well, so they keep getting updated, which is good. Moved here around four years ago and I'd not heard of him before. And then I started seeing all these little boxes being painted and I thought it was quite nice. Yeah, I think it is really good. I think it adds a bit of vibrant city to the area and kids love it. And he's got no plans to retire his paintbrush anytime soon. He's hoping to get some work done inside Ellen Road, but until then, We'll stick to brightening the streets of Leeds up one electrical box at a time. Marcus Smith, Keys News.